Everybody throws around the word brilliance like way too often. To me, he was truly brilliant. His speed was pedal to the floor brilliant. That brilliance is what everybody's looking for in this game. From a commercial side, I think he checks all the boxes. A son of the best sire in the country who was freakishly talented in an expensive, beautiful sale horse. It's literally just what the market desires. Larry Best is a man that stands behind his horses. I believe in what he's doing, so I did it myself. I bred two of my own mares to him. He's gorgeous, powerful, you know, looks the part. Looks like he should have been an early two-year-old like he was, and so far looks like he's passing that on. They look, to me, cookie cutter into mischief. They are the lighter bay with the white. I like the progeny to look like the sire, and um, they're certainly getting that done. Big, strong, has the white blaze like Instagram has. A lot of quality, a lot of stretch. She represents a stallion very well. All his good attributes, very correct, and a, quite a body on her. This is a really nice foal for this mare. He's very well balanced, he's well put together. Very typey, very compact, good mover. We're uh, really excited about the outcome. All of her foals so far has been real muscular, stocky built. This filly is the same way. She's got a little more classy head and got a little class about her. Yeah, we're very happy. Instagram is a horse that I would consider breeding back to. If all his foals look like that, uh, I think he'll do quite well. We've already bred two mares back to Instagram this year. Very excited to send more mares to Instagram going forward. Anytime you get a really solid physical like that, you've got to consider the stallion again. We sent five mares, we bred three mares back, two of them with the same mares. Like the Oh Wow's Empress Philly so much, we bred back to, to Instagram this year. Really, really pleased with, with these foals and look forward to seeing more of them.